When you think of a chef, you may imagine Carmi from the FX series The Bear. Yes, chef. Yes, chef. Or the friendly mouse from Disney's Ratatouille. I can't help myself. I, I like good food, okay? But what about Nala Chef, a fully automated kitchen run by AI? From robots to kitchen automation software, AI is changing the food business. Inside the Mall of India in Naperville, this fast casual food court has a kitchen that can operate all day. The way it works is we teach the system of different actions of that a human. First, what we do is uh, we watch a human uh, making a dish. Uh, we record that and then we feed it to the, to the system. And the robot actually would, would mimic those actions and we kind of fine tune it so that this action is, is perfected. Recipes are developed in a lab in India and then the code is copied and sent to the kitchen. But there's still a human touch. Uh, so we have uh, someone in the front who will punch in their order, and once the order is punched in, the robots are going to take it up and uh, they're going to start making the dish for you. The Nala robot can customize each dish to a customer's preference. If it's too salty, it can adjust the salt level in the food. So every single second, uh, the robot actually has a total of 1,200 sensors that work every microsecond to determine the, the taste of the food and the consistency of the food. Some chefs like Bill Kim of Urban Belly in Wicker Park aren't in favor of robots in the kitchen. We need people to cook our food. I can't have robots cooking our food. But they do use AI for prep work. His restaurant uses Pressy Taste, an AI prep assistant that helps decide how many ingredients to prepare for the day. Every time a technological innovation has been made in history that improved the quality of life, it's like these are more of tools for us uh, to improve the quality of our lives. While the robots may be hard at work here, they haven't taken over every kitchen. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.